Valentine Company Sick Array was established in 1972 and specializes in helicopters. Over the years, it has successfully collaborated with the Argentine Army and has delivered its products from Alaska to Australia. One notable achievement is their innovative simulator. A standard helicopter is mounted on a specialized pneumatic platform. This setup enables aspiring pilots to practice fundamental skills, such as hovering and close to ground maneuvering. The training takes place at a height of up to one meter, with all essential data conveniently displayed on the instructor's tablet. This simulator has proven to be cost effective, with an approximate 60 to 80% reduction in training expenses for the initial 10 flight hours, compared to real helicopter training. Check out this advanced technology, reminiscent of the movie Total Recall. A US company has engineered a headset capable of reading minds. It's equipped with sensors that track brain activity, including blood flow and electrical signals, providing insights into how the brain responds to the surrounding environment. The potential is vast. For instance, consider Relieve VR X, a therapy employing immersive VR environments to help patients manage chronic pain. Moreover, these headsets could enable product manufacturers to gain deep insights into customer reactions by delving into their thoughts. By 2030, developers hope to make these headsets as affordable as smartphones, ushering in a new era for fields like neuromedicine, neuromarketing, and other neurosciences. Back in 1984, the European market saw the debut of the first trailer featuring a moving floor. This design was remarkably successful and remains available in various versions today. As a tribute to its original design, the next model boasts an impressive capacity, capable of transporting over 35 tons of diverse cargo, including bulk materials. Boasting more than 200 customizable options, advanced robotic solar welding, 93 cubic meters of space, a length of 13.7 meters, and remote control functionality, it's no surprise that the manufacturer's dealer network extends across over 20 countries. Hailing from Finland, this team proudly presents the world's first all 18 wheel drive electric ETV. The rapid progress of this innovation is notable. Last year saw the assembly of the initial prototype, and this October, they're set to unveil an upgraded version with enhanced suspension. Moreover, you can already sign up for a test drive if you're not intimidated by the top speed of 110 km per hour. The ACV boasts a 100 kg load capacity and operates for 4 to 8 hours on a single charge. Notably, it conquers obstacles up to 200 mm high without sacrificing speed. We wonder how expensive it will be. Is switching locomotives to hydrogen a practical idea? Well, financially, it seems so. These hydrogen-powered locomotives are expected to be 5-7% to more cost-effective over their entire lifespan compared to traditional ones. This interesting experiment is happening in Poland, and what you see here is a revamped SM42 locomotive. The setup is quite straightforward. Four 180 kilowatt traction engines, two 85 kilowatt hydrogen cells, and a 167 kilowatt hour battery. The cabin has also seen some changes. Equipped with autonomous driving and obstacle detection systems, this locomotive can now be operated by just one person. Armband, priced at $149, is available to everyone and lets you control different devices using hand movements. The project began around 2012, but even now, the gadget remains impressive. The team devised something more interesting than gyroscopes. This armband detects electrical signals produced by muscle movements and can interpret gestures like clenching your fist or waving. These movements can be assigned specific commands. For instance, you can wave to rewind a video. The armband works within a range of 10 meters and comes with a Bluetooth adapter for PCs and laptops. Additionally, it's compatible with various popular systems, from Windows to iOS.
A common challenge for modern drones is their limited flight time due to high energy consumption. The creators of this impressive drone found a clever solution. When possible, the drone moves by rolling instead of flying. This enables the drone to operate five times longer than its counterparts. Its versatile design makes it suitable for various tasks, from inspecting mines to military reconnaissance. Currently, the manufacturers are fine-tuning the drone, while also seeking investors. They highlight strong interest in the prototype from hundreds of companies. Exciting developments are unfolding in South Korea, where they've put together a six-legged underwater robot. It kind of looks like a crab, and fittingly, they've named it the Crabster. The purpose behind its design is simple. It can navigate coastal areas with strong underwater currents. These areas are not suitable for swimming, but perfect for walking, albeit at a leisurely pace. The CR200 model manages around 1.5 kilometers per hour. What's interesting is that its front legs can also function as manipulators if equipped accordingly. Additionally, the robot contributes to updating underwater maps using a sonar with a range of up to 150 meters. Retailers and warehouse workers are feeling the shift. Around 25% of global purchases are now done online, and warehouses are seeing more automation. For instance, Ocado, the world's biggest online food marketplace, smoothly serves over half a million British shoppers by shipping products directly from its warehouse. One standout feature is the Ocado Smart Platform, a digital service suite available for everyone. At the forefront today, it embraces artificial intelligence, machine learning, and digital twins. This enables it to anticipate demand and even predict customer preferences, allowing a basket of 50 items to be picked in mere minutes. Flight disruptions are a common issue, affecting airports globally. Even major ones like Paris Charles de Gaulle face delays. No wonder various airports are adopting a simple yet effective solution. Finnish designed passenger rest pods. Why overcomplicate? They feature birch plywood walls, comfy textiles and fiberglass, plus cozy mattresses. The luggage fits inside, and the detachable mattress and pillows ensure comfort. You can conveniently charge your gadgets thanks to the built-in USB port. A unique creation from MIT, a deformable material. It's composed of solid plates or rods and flexible joints, allowing components to be pieced together like building blocks. This construction set can be used to create nearly anything. Imagine crafting a protective shell where each block morphs, twists or scales up and down according to a preset plan. This trailer is truly on a whirlwind tour, surpassing some celebrities. In the last year, it covered around 30,000 kilometers across 27 countries. It's named the Solar Butterfly, and it embodies its purpose. Unfolding its wings, it transitions from a caterpillar-like form, showcasing the ease of moving from fossil fuels to renewable energy. Remarkably, that's enough for the trailer to travel up to 300 kilometers per day. Inside, it boasts a fully-fledged mini-house setup with a kitchen, toilet, shower, and six beds. Chinese engineers are gearing up for a significant task. According to news reports, China plans to engage in moon and asteroid mining in the coming decades. China also holds a wealth of resources, including over half of the global raw material production for cement. After a day's labor, it's wise for workers to clean their boots, preventing dirt and dust spread. That's why local stores offer these systems, many of which operate automatically. They efficiently clean even coal dust swiftly and effectively without harming the boots.